welcome back to my channel so this is going to be a part two I recently shared all of my updated colouring boot collection now some of my colouring boots I have took apart and binded them or they're in folders as well as PDFs, singles, books, you know that sort of thing and I'm going to add in my art books and tutorial books at the end just in case anyone was interested now the ones that I've got right at the top are the ones that I'm working on at the moment so this is one that I just finished last night and this page is by Mariola Boudec and this was purchased off Etsy and how adorable is that this is not my usual colouring style or my usual you know page that I would choose to do but I couldn't resist it as soon as I saw it I knew that I had to colour this one how cute is that bunny at the bottom but this is not a finished page so I'm not going to go into too much detail so that is by Mariola Boudec along with this one I've got this single PDF as well uh, I just thought the dress was beautiful on that and I've printed these out on tan tone paper a few more Misty Cat Mirrors, just singles, there's not enough to bind just yet. These are the Christmas pages, so that's from Tan Toned and then the grey paper. We've got a book that I did and binded it upside down. That's uh, <laughs> that's what I did when I first started using the binding machine and I couldn't figure out how to properly use it. So technically it's not uh, upside down if I do it like this, but the band's on the wrong side. So this is all Hannah Lynn, so Hannah Lynn PDFs that I've bought off Etsy and then just printed out on my own paper. So yeah, that's Hannah Lynn. All of these next few that I'm going to be showing you are all Hannah Lynn. I can't remember specifically what boot they came out of. I didn't keep the front covers, unfortunately. But again with this one, I did it wonka. But I did add a thicker piece of card to just place over it. Again, this was before I made my own uh, covers. So this is, P I think this is two, this is not PDFs, this is the physical book that I've took apart and then just binded back together myself. Um, I don't remember which books these were. I know that's a steampunk one and that's a princess one, I think, or fairy tale one maybe at the front. But yeah, as you can see, some of them are upside down. It took me a long time to learn how to use that binding machine. Uh, we've got a folder next, which some of these I'm going to have to, I can't properly remember what they are myself. So we've got the Halloween Hannah Linen here. Uh, we've got the, I think it's Victorian Darlings in that one. And then we've got the Christmas one at the back. So my idea with these, if I, I can colour straight onto the, the image itself, but what I've been doing is uh, scanning them and printing them off on my own paper. So that I did this one in Christmas in June, this page here, I know there's a lot of glow, I do apologise. I did do that one in Christmas in June, I think, I think it was, pretty sure it was. Uh, and the smaller folder. So that was the recent Mystic Kite Mirrors that you would have seen on the channel. We've got more Hannah Lynn, we've got the Christine Karen that I finished off. But I'm not going to bind absolutely everything because I want to make sure that I've got enough to bind to make a book. So once I've got enough pages then I will bind them. But I can't remember which Hannah Lynn's these came from, but yeah they're all Hannah Lynn. And then we've got, let me just check again, this is Hannah Lynn, so I think it's this way around and I did it completely back to front again. So I think this one was the girls working or working girls or it was something along the lines of that anyway. But I've printed them out on different colour papers, so cream and then white and then cream and then white again. So another folder, this is a mixture of different artists in this and there's finished pages and there is just the PDFs in here. Some of them I've actually written down what I've done, there's my dinosaur page. I do remember these ones, these ones are any colour in the next couple that come up. Mythical Women Part 3, we've got another Hannah Lynn finished page. So yeah, they do need to be a little bit more organised. But it'll take me a long time, I think. 
these were again any colouring I did actually a private message on Instagram and requested would she do a few dinosaur pages for me and she actually made a full book which I was really really pleased about and I've done three out of the book so far this is a it's not I always have Tim Holtz at the back of my head so uh, Tim Jeffs this is a PDF of Tim Jeffs uh, there's dinosaurs in this as well somewhere and there's a bit of a mess up there's the Mosasaur there's the T-Rex and there was a Stegosaurus that I need to reprint because I don't like it again random artists that I cannot remember the name of these if I look back at my old purchases through Etsy then I would be able to find out and here another one printed out and not coloured there's a couple of different things in there it's quite thick yeah there's just different PDFs in there but I tend to print um, if I buy a full book I, I won't just print the one page out I like to have them all printed out because I know what I'm like for forgetting that I've got them so if I've got them as a physical copy let me check if this is the right way around no it's not yeah if I've got them as a physical copy I find it better like that so this is another PDF this isn't the Amazon printed this is Popular PDF again purchased off Etsy. Lovely images. And that one, where did you go? It just caught my eye. Let me just find it because I want to take that one out. And I do want to start that one. I do apologise. This one here, I am going to take this out. This one is a Diamond Art Club painting at the moment, so I'm keeping that out because I do want to colour that one. So I'm going to pop that to one side and put in my to do list. Uh, this was just on the pile or in the little cube that I keep uh, all my PDFs and stuff and Etsy purchases. So this is Sakum's Dark Fantasy, the 2019 colouring book, the PDF again purchased off Etsy on the watercolour paper this one very nice book this one is the one that I binded on the channel and I messed up the cover but it doesn't matter this is another one that uh, I really really want to do because it's gonna, it is a Diamond Dark Club painting and this is the Mythical Maidens I'm pretty sure it's the Mythical Maidens and it, there might be another book in here as well because it does seem quite thick. And a, the Princess one maybe? I'm not entirely sure. I need to decorate the front and back cover of that one though. My beloved Mystic Art Mirrors, the one that I did properly behind up and did the front cover, the back cover, everything. I thoroughly recommend these books. The artwork is gorgeous. And I just like the fact that I've made this myself. That's another one that I did. Another one that I did quite a few in this last month and the month before. Another one. Is there any in the middle? No. Beautiful, beautiful book. We've got another one that I've binded myself, which is the Harry Potter one. And I need to do one of these pictures for my niece she uh, likes Harry Potter so I said that I would do one of these for her I need to ask her which one actually so I believe that this is by Fabiana Attiano all the Harry Potters and I've just done the one at the back of Voldemort uh, again this is just kept on the um, the same cube shelf but this is a, you can, it is available on Etsy but I did purchase this second hand off a Facebook group. See so lovely images, spiral bound, fantastic quality. Uh, Micah Janana, Jelana, I'm terrible at pronouncing, I'm butchering people's names, I do apologise. We've got Mariola Budek, which this is the set of art plus other single PDFs that I've bought from her Etsy store. And I've just binded them all together. See, that's where it's signed. I kept that at the front. 
that is before I coloured one of the images I scanned it into my computer printed it off just in case I wanted to do it again and let's work from the back it might be easier there's my queen the one with the long hair I just love this book absolutely love it the only problem is with binding is you can't add to it I think once you've um, committed to binding them pages together that's sort of it where I have accumulated a few more Mariola pages which I would have liked in that book but it's not the end of the world so did I bind this properly that way around that way around and I can't remember the artist of this one either I, I don't think it's written down anywhere but if anybody's interested I will uh, try my best to leave links down below to where these can be purchased but more grayscale images as you can see parrots that sort of thing and I did add just a nicer front cover on that one and this one was a total mess up look at the mess of this I used too big of a coil I think for the um, for the book but this is the Sakums this is two colouring books in one and I did put these all together which in hindsight now I should have just done them separately instead of adding them all together but you live and learn if I don't show you my mistakes I'm not human and this is the file that I just need to uh, sort out so this is definitely a mixture of all sorts in here if I can even open it so I'm going to have to move my little white let's move it to the other side Uh, I've just got a couple of single PDFs that I just need to fit into folders. Got a Laura Rafferty Mario Ruby deck. Again, I don't remember the name of that artist. I printed it off twice, I don't know. We've got some Mystic Art Mirrors. And I did that all with watercolour. All of it, even down to the skin. I was really pleased with how that turned out. We've got some Hannah Cowles on, on watercolour paper. Normal paper. Two of them. I don't know why I've printed off two of each of them. I believe I did this one on the channel. I'm not overly impressed with how that one turned out. More Hannah Cowles on. And I printed it off twice again. That one is the one that I completed that I weren't happy about. More Mystic Art Mirrors. Hannah Lynn. I do try and keep these as organised as I can. These just need to go in the little folders, I think. Now, this one and this one was a freebie. I'd already purchased this as a PDF, but then it was sent to me as a freebie because I bought the Momo Girls Love Letter. So I got them free as a PDF. But like I said, I already owned the, uh, this PDF and I've already coloured it. So let's just go ahead and put that in there. Let's keep that safe. Yeah, I can definitely probably fit all them in here. I've got a lot of loose sleeves. Got a Hannah Lynn. That same image, but that's printed on watercolour paper, so I can give that a good go with some of the raw, uh, Paul Rubin watercolour paints, maybe. A failed attempt at alcohol markers. <laughs> Hannah Lynn again. Hannah Lynn. Harriola Bidek. The dragon one that I can't remember the name of. More of the dragon one. A free Christmas one of the uh, Mariola Boudet. She did that last year. All of the dragon ones. Let me get three. We then get to Mystic Art Mirrors PDF. Again, I can't remember the name of this book. Turn over. More free Mariola Boudet there. Yeah, so that's all Mystic Art Mirrors. All her PDFs. There's a few different ones actually. A few different books here. And then we've got more Hannah Lynn. More Hannah Lynn at the back. A Pokemon uh, book that I bought off Etsy again. Just a little PDF. And I think that is it. I'm probably missing. You're always, you're always going to end up missing something. But I think that, apart from pictures that I've done and gifted to people that I knew that they would like, I think that is all of my PDFs. And you've seen all of my colouring books. Yeah, you can see there on the back of that, that was um, because I ordered from Etsy and they sent them for free. 
so that is all my pdfs all of my coloring books but like i said if you're anything like me you turn the camera off and then you find something that you were meant to show in the video <laughs> but thank you very much for watching and i will try my best to link all of the pdfs that i mentioned down below in the description if you are interested but thank you very much for watching please do like the video and subscribe if you're new and i will see you in the next one bye